Rolio, you're next. It's been the Junior Green is so simple and Leo, the pride. Uh, seven of Pentacles. The lovers, you could be dealing with Gemini. Uh, some kind of contract. Uh, what should our Leos be aware of in the pride today? Uh, the fool embarking on a new journey. A new love offer coming in. Hmm. That's nice. Not me, Mr. Popular, or Mrs. Popular. You choose to identify it. Uh, okay. In the challenge, we got four pentacles, so you could be a little bit broke. No muchos dineros, and a king of cups. So possible cancerian energy. Yeah, somebody master feeling in control of his feelings still might uh, let him get his feelings get the best of him once in a while but, uh, I don't know he looks pretty ice cold there look at him look at the face on this guy is that a dude or I don't even want to think this is the pagan uh, tarot deck I don't want to put a hex on me so it's so, him or her or whatever you choose to identify as her what is that in the background? Is that a reindeer? Oh, no, it's a caribou. Caribou. Hmm. This could be Canadian. There's not caribou in the States, is there? No, that's... Is that a caribou or a moose? Hmm. King of Cups, caribou. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe there's caribou in the States. Maybe around the Rockies, I guess, probably. Uh... There's a big bullfrog there, I noticed too, and a ram. And. Uh, could have a male. Some uh, male. Um, looking at you kind of hard there. See how the way that moose is looking at that, that dude's back? It looks like he wants to. Uh, I don't know, it looks like he wants to. Like ram them or something, isn't it? Yeah, maybe the bullfrog. I don't know. Yeah, four pentacles. Okay, so the challenge is you're a little low on dineros, and you've got uh, king of cups who might be a challenge for you. So that makes sense because your fire sign and fire water don't usually mix that good, right? So unless you're Pisces. Or, um, what have we got in the Bottom of the deck, we got the fool, so you could be embarking on a new journey. Uh, with the kitty. Hmm. Kind of cool. Looks like she's walking in outer space there, right? Hmm. Hmm. It's kind of cool. So, what do we got subconsciously? What are you thinking of there, Leo? Uh, oh, 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 this one? Okay, so subconsciously you're thinking about closing out a cycle. So, closing out a cycle. Subconsciously, what do you got in the past? How did we get here? Leo, you know, two of pentacles, and this one will become a nine of wands. Nine of wands is like strength. So, strength and two of pentacles is juggling. So, in the past, you might have been juggling, but you had. You gained some kind of strength out of this, or you were strong. This is like the feminine. Oh no, this isn't. This is like uh, strength from burdens. So this is like strength gained from resistance. So you had some burdens, and you gained strength from it. It's a nine. Four. So you got. Okay. That's in the past. Though. Who cares about the past, right? We got the glory, so we can't go back. It's. Uh, we got in the present. We got these two. Six of Swords and uh, Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so slowest moving knight in the in the deck. So somebody is yeah, slow. They're slowly sailing off the calmer waters to get a break from these burdens. 
and that turned into strength because nine is you know, one's a strength but one more and it'll break to the uh, to the ten of wands which is ultimate burdens right so uh, yeah so you just came out of some kind of turmoil there because see the house is on fire there I don't know maybe grandpa fell asleep on the couch with a cigar or some shit like that and you had to toss him out the window into the canoe and just I don't know Throw him in the water a bit there and shock the system and get the fire off him. Because stop dropping and rolling doesn't work in a canoe, in case you didn't know. They don't tell you that in school anymore. Even without that, I usually flip those things. So, yeah. And two, three, past, present. What have we got in the future? Holy Spirit. For our Leos. We put it in uh, you got a page of wands, so the postman adventure, and a six of wands, which is victory. So you're adventuring, and you're going to get victory in this adventure, whatever you're doing. Maybe when you uh, presently you're going on this boat ride with uh, a little grandpa there, uh, and this uh, knight of pentacles. Yeah, it could be grandpa because grandpas are usually pretty slow, right? That's a slow moving knight. Uh, hmm. burnt down another shack, did we? Pray for that. Put insurance on it too. And in the future, we've got you got victory and a page of wands. So adventuring, victory, whatever you're adventuring at. That's your element too. So fire, fire, wands, air, more wands. Huh. There's a little bit of water in the harder situation. There's a love offer. We'll find out who it is in a second. The Empress. How are you influencing this situation there, Leo? Uh, seven of Cups. So you're influencing it by illusions. There's illusions or casting illusions, possibly. Uh, we'll, we'll get another one on that later. Hopes and fears. Hopes and fears. Three of Wands, so you're hoping to, you're hoping that your ships will come in, whatever you got going on, you're hoping that it'll pay off, you're sitting waiting for maybe, uh, you're doing a OnlyFans page on the computer there, and she's waiting for somebody to check out her legs or whatever, I don't know. So that could be what you're hoping for. Uh, what do we got in the lens you're looking through? Uh, these two? The Seven of Swords, which is uh, cheating, lying, and stealing. Eight of Pentacles, working hard at your craft. So you're working hard at cheating, lying, and stealing. This is the lens you're looking at? Oh, me. Who are you? Mr. Ocean or what? <laughs> what do we got in the uh, environment? I uh, got in the environment, you got a. Knight of Wands, so player energy with a magician, so a tricky player and a reversed Ace of Pentacles, a tricky player that somehow lost a gift from spirit that you can taste, touch, and feel in the environment. Magician, eh? we'll pull on that magician and see if he's upright in a bit. So in the outcome, what do we got in the outcome here? The Emperor, okay, so Aries energy, somebody who's a uh, very powerful person, likes to control things, justice, okay, so Emperor, justice, and a star, wow, holy shit, that's some powerful energy there, that's three major, uh, yeah, three major arcanas, it's uh, Libra, Aquarius, and uh, Aries, so you need two air signs and a uh, fire sign. So I'm thinking you could possibly be this emperor. Uh, well, emperor King Body Hall. Four kings in the deck. Mm. You could possibly be this emperor. Uh, boss in cheating, lying, and stealing. So you could be like you could be like Mr. Ocean. Or you could be knocking off a casino here. Maybe that's the casino in your like uh, present moment there. You just I don't know. You're in the 
this is in fact maybe Grandpa didn't fall asleep on the couch there with a cigar and burn the shack down. Maybe that's uh that's, I don't know, cheating, lying and stealing. Did you just like go do a Viking raid on somebody or is that a long boat or a canoe? Let me see. Uh, okay. Riding out of the red. No, that's not riding out of the red. Justice, okay. Aries Libra Aquarius. So somebody who's powerful, who's calling in justice and faith, hope, and healing. So you're having faith, hope, and healing about justice. Uh, this could be like a uh, captain of the police or something, because it's somebody who's a boss, like the emperor. So maybe this is the outcome. This is maybe uh, who you're dealing with. If you're cheating, lying, and stealing, <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> well, okay. You're gonna have to definitely clarify this. So at the bottom of the deck, you got the Empress. So you got an Emperor and an Empress out here, a couple, like a power couple. So let's clarify with the Hermetic deck here. Let's see what's going on here. Uh, seven of Wands, Seven of Wands, so could have just kind of. See, yeah, you definitely did something here. Like, that's not like Grandpa falling asleep on the. with uh, Kahiba. That's like fucking. Uh, like, I don't know, maybe, you know, if you're cheating, lying, and stealing, and, uh, like, that's your job, you're working hard at cheating, lying, and stealing, maybe you, I don't know, just did a score on somebody and left their house burning or something, I don't know, maybe that's, uh, we'll definitely clarify that, let's shuffle this up a bit, For Leo, Leo. Like we can get a soul cycle of Leo. And then this deck holds me. I should be aware of it. And the first one I do is, uh, who's this love offer in the uh, heart of the situation? Who's bringing this love offer? Holy Spirit. Uh, no, he's two. Okay, so possibly a Scorpio. Okay, an Empress. Who else? So the last one we read there, Cancer had an Empress as a love offer to you in the last read. So, this Empress, Scorpionic Empress, an Empress transforming in a transformation possibly, Scorpio transforming, hmm. an Empress who's transforming is bringing in the love offer, uh, somehow going through transformation. So possibly she's trying to transform you because you're cheating, lying, and stealing, and that's your job. Maybe the Empress doesn't like that, right? Because she's kind of, uh, she can embody all four queens in the deck, right? Maybe she listens to your stories because uh, she's, that's what she does, right? She's uh, the one who listens, and the Emperor's the one who shouts shit at you, right? So um, it's probably better to talk to the Empress about that, I'm thinking. Uh, and this. Let's put these back. Clarifying here. The challenge you've got a King of Cups. Who's this King of Cups in the challenge? For Leo. This one? Okay, the last judgment. So the challenge is judgment's being called down. Like, this is divine judgment. So it's not really. It could be called down, I guess, for prayer or whatever. But most likely somebody's. Uh, I'm thinking it could be you because if you're. Job is cheating, lying, and stealing. You know, sooner or later, you're gonna get judged for that, right? So this could possibly be uh, this um, King of Cups judging you, or call, uh, maybe he's like uh, the judgment. Like it doesn't have to be fire and brimstone. It could be an adversary, right? Uh, and in the past, uh, who cares about the past? Okay, what's with this uh, shack on fire? Is this like somebody just? Uh, do jack move on the nine of cups here so that's lord of material happiness okay so you did do jack move and the lord of success unfulfilled so maybe you weren't as successful maybe you didn't get the safe maybe you uh only um i don't know what the heck you're, you're doing there we'll clarify that a little more uh chain line and stealing lord of success unfulfilled but material happiness so maybe you got enough cash for whatever but you 
didn't get there all of what you wanted because your success was unfulfilled. And in the future, you got a page of wands adventure with victory. This is probably you I'm thinking. So, um, what's this do you gain victory over? And, oh, wait. Justice and the high priestess is powerful energy. Libra. What do we got in, uh, what's this victory over in the future? For our Leos. Oh, this one? The victory over this Knight of Pentacles. An earth sign, possibly slow moving knight. Possibly bringing in a uh, message about material things. Could be an investment too, because it's slow moving. This guy likes bushwhacking, eh? So, like his horse is like, him and his horse, they go bushwhacking and they got addicted to like certain, uh, well, the horse is addicted to like mushrooms, so he's not even moving because he's tripping the balls. And the guy riding the horse here, the uh, Knight of Pentacles is like, he's really tripping because he looked like the the toad's balls he found in the forest there. And he thinks he's doing 100 kilometers an hour. His horse isn't even moving. And he's swinging around at shit that's not even there. So that's why he takes so long to get wherever he's going, right? So mm, that's in the future. So you got victory over that guy. That's not that hard to accomplish, so really, so. But anyways, congratulations. Uh, what are these illusions you got in the way of influence of things? Oh, what's on here? Okay. Illusions. A lot of harmonious change. So maybe you're, you're, you're hoping for a harmonious change by casting illusions. Maybe you're distracting somebody because your job is cheating, lying, and stealing. Whatever cancer I'm pulling out right now anyway. Or, uh, sorry, Leo I'm pulling out right now. Uh, hopes and fears, three of wands. So what are you waiting for to come in? in uh, your hopes, what are you waiting for? Queen of Pentacles, so a sugar mama. Queen of the Thrones of the Earth, usually pretty abundant. Uh, Earth sign? Okay. My nails myself. <laughs> what do we got in the uh, lens you're looking to? Uh, by the cup, so sadness and loss from cheating, lying, and stealing. Sadness and loss. Okay, so you didn't get what you wanted to. You got some cash apparently because you get a load of material happiness. So maybe you got some, I don't know, whatever you got. Maybe it wasn't even cash. Maybe it was like uh, some, I don't know. You don't even know that, right? You know your story. What you got in the environment? You lost a gift from spirit. So you're doing tricky. This is a knight of wands. So being a player, a tricky player. <laughs> the environment, you're being a tricky player and you lost a gift from spirit. Okay. Tell us what you want to tell us about that. Let's see. Oh. Okay. Queen of wands. So you could have been. Uh, this Knight of Wands, I um, messed around with the Queen of Wands. Yeah, she can be a little frisky sometimes. And a Three of Wands, so you're waiting for something, ships to come in there too. So maybe you're waiting for her to, her uh, child tax benefit to come in or something, and you're going to rob her too. Since your job is cheating, lying, and stealing. Just your story. What do we got in, okay, in the environment, we got this Emperor. Who's this Emperor? Oh, that's an ace of cups, so a new love offer possibly. And justice and the star. What do you got on justice? Oh. You've got spying, so you could be under investigation and somebody could be spying on you. could be, I don't know, don't be chipping out and walking through the blinds every five minutes. And, but you could possibly be under investigation because somebody's spying on you. And it's justice, so it's Libra energy. So it could be like, uh, I don't know, CSIS or... FBI, I don't, I don't want to freak you out or anything, but probably am, since you're in the um, job of cheating, lying, and stealing, you might be a little worried too. Uh, who's the star in, uh, in the, um, in the uh, upcoming, okay, the star, oh my god, so we got another demon here, clarifying the star is the devil, so 
when you got the devil and a star, that's a fallen star, which is like a fallen angel, which is a demon, so. Uh, okay. So. What demon? Let's, let's do this. Let's do this a totally different deal for this. Let's use this crystal tarot deck. For what kind of demon we're doing with that? And yesterday was Asmodeus, so. It must be. 42 legions of. Other devils, demons, or anything. He's actually a badass mofo because he's good. He's one of the top seven. And apparently, so. Church of Gambling. Ox head. He's got two heads an ox head, a goat head. I, know, I screwed that up yesterday. In Pisces. Mm. Gain control your environment. And a king of wands. Mm. I'm going to find this demon. Fire sign, gaining control of your environment. Mm. So it could be like a. Uh, 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 who are we dealing with here? This fallen star, Holy Spirit. Let's. Uh, which one is he? Give us a clue here. King of Cups. So somebody who uh, is good with his feelings. He's. Um, He's in charge. He's uh, in control of his feelings. So somebody who uh, possibly a water demon. Uh, okay, you need more than that. Water could be a water. Um, uh, what do you got? In? What else do you want to test with this man? He's bringing in a, a love offering. Okay, so possibly a succubus or an incubus. Bring in a love offering. Uh, water. Water elemental. Uh, wow, well, eh? Could be this, uh, what do we got here? Where is it? she in this one? No, I don't think she is. Hmm. Mm -hmm. uh, I thought I seen her. No, maybe not. Water mm, could be like uh, another last one. Uh, that's water, so mm, uh, I get another one. Oh. Night of Wands. Oh, so that's a player of Wands. Okay, so he's a player energy, so it could be as well. Yes, again here. Uh, bringing in love offers a player energy. King of Cups and control of his feelings. Yeah, he would be. Uh, what else? Can you give us another one of these pictures. A Knave of Pentacles. So slow moving. Uh, what else? This is um, a student. Okay, so somebody who maybe teaches, teaches something or is learning something. Mostly, usually they teach things. They don't usually learn things, right? Uh, so. Mm. I'll be teaching uh, an earth. Mm. I need another one. One more, one more. One more. Two, okay. So, two of pentacles, juggling, could be juggling. So, yeah, player energy could be in lust. And the sun, so shining light on something, Leo energy, uh, fire, uh, Leo energy, juggling. Could be as well, yes, again. We'll see. What else do you want to clarify here? The universe. What are you closing out a cycle with here? What are you closing out a cycle with? Eight of Wands. So. Let's see what it says in this book. Let me read this book. Combined intentions and ideas and achieving a goal. So achieving a goal. Hmm. So you're closing out a cycle with that. Give me another one on this Empress transforming here. Empress transforming. Priestess and 
Seven of Pentacles. Oh. High Priestess and Seven of Pentacles. Hmm. Charity. Divide the and share possessions. Okay, so High Priestess could be like giving out charity. Uh, so maybe that's her love offering. She's giving her some cash. Or trying to butter you up. Bottom of the deck here, we got a King of Wands again, so. And you do go, I'd be cautious. Okay, what's your advice with this? Uh, give me an angel card for any of your advice on this uh, falling stack here. At least we can just get one card possible. Let's see here. What we got? For whatever. The lovers, okay, so Archangel Raphael, which is kind of in charge of like love and shit like that, like, uh, mm. Mm. intimate relationships carefully weigh your decisions, okay, and good health, so maybe this thing could be trying to attack your health, or carefully weigh your decisions, yes, yeah, so any decisions you make, be careful, because whatever that fog stars could be uh, influencing you. Uh, maybe smudge your place or cleanse your place, however you do that. Uh, what else do you want to talk? Is there anything else? Eight of water. Desire to move on, to search for something. Yeah, that's what I would do. I'd walk away whatever this thing is around you. I'd walk away from it. But you might have attracted it to you through cheating, lying, and stealing too. So... I don't know, sometimes when you, you know the lifestyle like that, you can attract even just some of the thing, possessions that you get might have something attached to it, you know what I mean? You never know what you're really getting. Because apparently you didn't get cash, but you got material happiness in your little heist or whatever you did. So have a good one, then.